Holy crap, guys, dude, my upload schedule has been completely freaking garbage lately. And quick side note real quick. What the crap is this? Is it? Th wait, 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 wait. Hold on one second. Is this the Tempered Wolf actually uploading early access gameplay? What the crap is going on, man? He got early access? What? <laughs> But yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. After three freaking days of not uploading, I'm finally back here bringing you guys another video. And GameStop actually pulled through with me this year. And they actually, I got my code this year. Because if you guys remember last year, uh, Black Ops 3, Activision, whatever, they never emailed me a code. GameStop never emailed a, me a beta code for Black Ops 3. So I did get the... I did get the early access code because I did pre-order Infinite Warfare, so the Legacy Edition, so I got it. I got that COD 4 remaster, and, and I'm bringing it to you guys today. But let me go back real quick uh, to uh, my upload schedule. So I literally I really hate myself, but I haven't uploaded in a really long freaking time. Uh, three days is a, is a long time for me. I know most of you guys out there are going to be like, that is a long time. What the crap are you talking about? No, like seriously, for me, it's a long time because I'm used to uploading every single day. You guys know this. I talk about it all the time, but I'm used to uploading every single day and three days without uploading. That's a major problem, but I did, however, get early access to Call of Duty for Modern Warfare Remastered and unfortunately, all we get is the campaign, but that's the video. I'm uh, That's the gameplay I'm going to be bringing you guys today and the one thing... I really don't like about this is uh, like every single time I play the campaign me playing this Call of Duty can this uh, COD 4 remastered campaign has just made me want to play the multiplayer so bad that's like the like worst part about this is when you play early access for Call of Duty 4 remastered you're getting all that nostalgia feeling and it just feels great but it's like you want to play multi multiplayer even five times more than you wanted to before because you're playing the campaign it's like this is so much fun all the graphics are updated everything looks nice and clean but it's like you want to play multiplayer so bad that's the only bad thing about this but this was actually my first playthrough on the call of duty 4 remastered modern warfare remastered campaign so hopefully you guys will enjoy that and i do apologize about the sound man it's like every I'm, I'm really trying to get my sound thing figured out because it's like not capturing through my pvr you guys know i absolutely hate my freaking pvr have tons of problems with it 24 freaking 7 but i'm trying to get that uh you know trying to get that worked out at the moment and you know hopefully i get that fi I, actually i do have it figured out it just didn't record in this gameplay for whatever reason but my next gameplay will have sound definitely be assured of that so anyways th this this is seriously really fun that's basically my whole my this whole entire video is just gonna be talking to you guys about this campaign so far i absolutely love call of duty 4 remastered it's a great game so far from what i can see everything looks so clean you guys could tell by the graphics graphics look absolutely amazing raven software did absolutely good work on this i can like this is a great the absolutely great good job to raven software I, from what i could tell so far it's really fun. I really like playing this. I didn't really get to play it that much uh, and when it was actually on like the 360 and PS3 and the main reason for that is I really didn't care about campaigns and I actually started on MW3. That's what got me into Call of Duty. So I, d I didn't really, I never played COD 4. So when I got COD 4, all I did was play the multiplayer. I rarely ever played the campaign. So probably throughout this gameplay, you'll just see me wandering around random places seeing where to go because honestly, even though they walk you through it a lot, some Sometimes I just don't know where to maneuver around here because I've never played the COD 4 campaign. Only little pieces of it, but honestly, it's really fun. I've really enjoyed it so far, even though I'm not a huge campaign person and I really didn't like, I don't really like Call of Duty campaigns. I mean, they're good. I mean, I, they're, I, I don't have anything against them. I just don't like playing them myself. Like, they're good campaigns, but campaign isn't really my style of playing call of call of duty i really like multiplayer as you guys know and that's kind of what made me really want to play a multiplayer for this game but unfortunately we don't get that for about another month which is okay you know that's I, that's completely fine i don't have anything against that but honestly october is going to be so much like so many good things happening okay so we just got early access to the cod 4 
remastered campaign. So that actually came out on October 4th, I believe. So four days ago. I know I'm super, super, super late. But like I said, a lot of crap has been happening in my life with school and work and all that. And also this month, at October 14th, so some uh, sometime around next week, we'll be getting the Infinite Warfare beta. So we don't have long to the Infinite Warfare beta, which is going to be awesome, which is completely crazy. Uh, Call of Duty beta, like uh, less than a month before the game actually released. I don't think we've ever seen this before. Like the Black Ops 3 beta came out in what, freaking August or something like that? Like it's absolutely insane. But yeah, so we're going to be getting the uh, Infinite Warfare beta on October 14th. You guys know I'll be bringing that to you guys unless Activision decides to screw me over again and not give me a freaking code. It, whether that's Activision's fault or GameStop's fault, I'm still freaking ticked off about that. I didn't even get the Black Ops 3 beta. But anyways, after the Infinite Warfare beta, don't quote me on this. I think it's the 21st, something around there. But Battlefield 1 comes out like almost a week after the Infinite Warfare beta. So, it's going to be a jam-packed month for like for my channel and bringing you guys gameplays cuz honestly Black Ops 3 is dead. I'm probably I'm going to be 100% honest with you guys. I'm probably never going to get back on Black Ops 3 <laughs> because I I'm already prestige master. I mean, I gave up on doing Dark Matter camo. Screw that freaking crap. But honestly, I I don't want to play Bla Black Ops 3 anymore. So, really, it's going to be a jam-packed month anyhow because we're going to be getting COD 4. I already we have COD 4 Remastered Multiplayer, we're going to be getting the Infinite Warfare Beta, and then we're going to be getting Battlefield 1, and soon after that, Infinite Warfare and COD 4 Remastered are coming out, the Legacy Edition I'll be able to get, an, like, a, just a, about a week or two after the Battlefield 1 actually launches, which is going to be sweet, man, I seriously cannot wait, and if you guys did not know, if you did not know, November 6th marks our one year anniversary on YouTube and I don't say I because I say we because you guys are just as much as important to this channel as I am because you guys are what keeps this channel running which is absolutely fantastic can't thank you guys enough for that but anyways back to back to the COD 4 stuff so the remastered if you guys have not got it I mean honestly this is even though a lot of people don't want to pre-order Infinite Warfare and they think it's a complete waste of money which I can agree on 85 80 but well it's it's 80 bucks, but 85 bucks, 85 after taxes and all that bull crap. But uh, honestly, it's a lot of money to spend. But the early access, I think it's definitely worth it. This is so much fun. If you guys really enjoyed COD 4 Modern Warfare Remastered, the early access here is really good. And I really thoroughly enjoyed this campaign. Obviously, I'm not finished with it. I've only played it once. And, you know, because I haven't had a lot of time to play this, but I absolutely love it. It's awesome. But I'm really interested to see if I will actually, like, if I'll actually have to down... I don't think I'll have to download the campaign. So maybe that big Infinite Warfare, like, file that's going to be coming with the game, maybe it won't be as big for me. Because I hear a lot of people talking about how big the Infinite Warfare, like, game file will actually be to install on your PS4 or Xbox One. So I'm really interested to see how that's all going to pan out in November and see how everything's going to go with that because obviously if I already have the campaign I already have some of the memory of COD 4 Modern Warfare Remastered why would I have to download the same thing I have no idea but anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video here today, definitely make sure to smack that like button. That would be greatly, greatly, greatly appreciated. And if you guys are brand new to the channel, our channel's been growing a little bit now. I, I, I see some growth on the channel, just a tiny bit. But if you guys are brand new to the channel, definitely make sure to hit that subscribe button so you guys can be informed, updated on anything. Anything in YouTube, anything in gaming. Pretty much I cover it all. <laughs> so anyways, thank you guys all so much for watching the video here today. I super, super, super appreciate it. And with all of this being said here today, boys, this has been the one, the only, the Tippered Wolf. And I am signing the frick out of here. <laughs>